um, you also need to kind of keep your head warm. And because you're wearing a helmet, you need to find something that's going to fit underneath it. So a wool cap would be fine. They make um, these beanies that are very specific to white water. They fit nicely under your helmet. Um, and uh, they do a great job keeping the heat in the head there. Hands, it's always a struggle to keep your hands warm. So a good pair of gloves is what you're looking for. These work great. Um, they help your hands stay on the paddle. They're uh, designed this way so that your hands do not fatigue uh, trying to keep the hand bent on the paddle. They're already bent for you, which is nice. Uh, wool gloves will work fine too. Dish gloves with wool gloves inside taped to your wrist are fine out there as well. Um, perhaps not as classy as this, um, but still quite functional. And then to keep your feet warm, uh, which is a struggle because rafting your feet tend to be wet the whole time, a good pair of neoprene socks will work inside the booties that we showed you earlier. These offer um, a lot of warmth. You need to make sure that these are on not too tight. You want all this stuff to be sort of loose so you're not constricting blood flow. You want uh, nice wool socks inside here would be great. Outside here if it's super cold and then your neoprene socks would be good. Um, if you're wearing um, the dry suit with the Gore-Tex booties, then just wearing a nice pair of wool socks or these inside the Gore-Tex booties will help keep uh, you warm and toasty while you're out there on the river on a cold day.